I have um, a case, I mean, a recovery coach, and she was telling me that Hope Academy would be a good place for me to go because of all the things I was going through when I lived at home. So it was suggested that I try Hope Academy because it would also give me something to do. And I also wanted to make new friends. So I was like, okay, this will give me the opportunity because I know I'll be around a lot of people who are like me and I know I won't be judged. Well, before I came to Hebe Hebe House and, and before I finally moved out of my parents' house, I was just kind of living on, on, on my, with my family, doing chores and just, just kind of lazing around the house a bit. I just got tired of just sitting around there, so I finally went out to find the location of Hebeck House. I worked at a manufacturing company. I was there 28 days shy of 20 years full time, and I got let go. And um, I had a nervous breakdown. I, I, I needed money, and I didn't know what to do. And then my sister dropped to her knees, God help me, get Matt the help he deserves. This is from what she told me. And all of a sudden her phone rang and it was a friend who lived in Virginia. And she said that these programs existed. And I came here and I got employed November. I've been coming here since November 8th, 1999. Why do you think uh, HOPE is an advantageous program? It's a lot, because you're around a lot of people that are your age, and you know, you, like I said, you're able to relate to a lot of people, and people are very accepting. You guys, staff, like you guys want us to be happy. I know for me personally, you give me that feeling that like, no matter what, everything's gonna be okay. I think they're great programs because they help you deal with your mental illness, and and um, help you reach out to various um, various people and just get help. Uh, so would you recommend Hope Academy to any peers or other young adults suffering from mental illness? Yes. Why? Because it's a fun place to be. Especially the drop-in days are like awesome. You get to pick the movies. Not only does it get me out of the house on my days off, which it does, it puts me at ease knowing that there are other people here I can relate to. What has been your best experience at Hope so far? I keep saying it, but getting to know new people and able to be a joker, like, a, like with the boisterous personality is accepted. Well, well, I've been, um, I found a vol temporary volunteer position at the police department. I did various things such as um, assisting, getting items, um, organizing offices and storage and ride-alongs with the officers. How would you best describe Hope to someone who might not know about us? I, I would say it is a really good place to be, you know, got to give things a chance. Just like a friend of mine says, you got to give people and things a chance. Go in there positive and optimist, op optimistic and say, okay, today is a good day. I'm going to go in there and try this. And you might like it. I'm on my feet again. And I have nine more years and I can retire at 66. And that's all I care about. No, anyway, that's why I come here. I like it. It gives me independence. It gives me a sense of accomplishment. I have learned to better make good friends and to keep those friends thanks to Hope Academy and Hebeck House. I, I, went from, I went from having no friends to having an, a good amount of friends. It's a program that um, helps you reach your goals. And of course, one of the um, nice things about it is, is $2 um, lunches, which is always nice.